Your top story tonight, how old should you be to buy tobacco products? That's the question facing Indiana lawmakers. New at 10, the House will soon decide if that age should be raised from 18 to 21. WSBT 22's Heather Black is at the live desk, and Heather, lawmakers started hearing testimony today. Todd, tobacco companies and convenience stores voiced their concerns about how this bill could impact their businesses. Democratic Representative Charlie Brown from Gary sponsored the bill, and Brown says the health of Hoosiers is more important. The general manager of Vape and Smoke Shop along Ironwood says the hardest decision for his customers is picking the flavor of juice for their e-cigarettes. But a proposal in Indiana could change that. It's aiming to increase the age to purchase tobacco from 18 to 21. As far as business aspect goes, I don't think it's the greatest move just because the demographic in most areas for vapors or anyone who's switching from smoking into vaping, the demographic is usually between 18 to 25. Alejandre estimates the store could lose about 15,000 a month. You're going to find more people probably go different places, you know, Michigan, uh, which don't get me wrong, we have Michigan locations, but well, uh, to have a push to expand, you need all stores to grow together. And if three out of the seven stores are taking hits due to an age law, I think that's, that's gonna worry us big. State Representative Charlie Brown says changing the age will decrease health care costs for the state and help Indiana become healthier. I'm hoping that there will be this kind of consideration for this bill that send it on to the governor's office that we do not want persons under 21 years of age legally possessing tobacco products. The bill did look at increasing the tax on packs of cigarettes, but it was removed. Alejandre says taxing tobacco would be a better option for his business. It's a less sting than the age factor that I think a lot of us are focusing on now. And the bill does not include a certain age to sell tobacco products. That is a rule for alcohol sales. The bill just passed a House committee this morning, and it still needs to make it through the House and Senate. At the live desk, Heather Black, WSBT 22 News.